Greetings everyone. So today I want to cover a new feature in your Amazon Voice Assistant app that is going to make it easy for you to monitor your energy use around your house. All right, so there's a new feature in your Amazon Voice Assistant app. Now, this will only work with smart bulbs. So if you don't have any smart bulbs, this feature is not going to work for you. Now, number two, if you have smart bulbs, but they seem like they're not qualifying, like they're not showing up in the app, you can actually add those smart bulbs if the Amazon Voice Assistant recognize them as smart bulbs. I'm gonna show you how you can go in there and add them in to make them start being monitored by the app. So let's go over to the app and let's get this thing started. Okay, so once you get into the app, you wanna move over to devices. That's where you're gonna see the new feature. It's gonna be right beside the guard button. So you wanna swipe over to the right a little bit so you can see the energy dashboard. It's gonna be in between the guard and the hunches. So click on that one time, and then once it loads up, it's gonna show you that it's been monitoring your energy use. So it shows you your energy, and it shows that time, and then it shows the week and the month. Now the only thing that's monitoring at the current time is lights so as you can see right now it's telling me for the energy of this week i've used 111 watts per hour which is 70 percent down from last week now you can do the month view and it will give you a chart of how much you've been using the energy on each week and you can always go back and see how much energy you used the previous week so the previous week i've used 2.6 kilowatts versus this week i've used 739.9 watts and if you switch back to the week view you can do the same thing so i can go back and see what's my usage for the entire week of last week so on wednesday i use more energy than any other day of the week now if you really want to see how much energy you use on that day because right here is showing you the average so you just hold your finger down on it and it's going to pop up and let you know how much energy you use that actual day and you can do the same for each one of these days now next to energy you have time so when you click on the time it's going to show you how long in hours that you've been having whatever energy you've been using so on average i've been using 3.2 hours and that's up 24 percent from last week so the previous week so as you can see looking at the chart my energy has been fluctuating up and down but for some reason on Sunday, I use more energy than any other day. So this is giving you a detailed breakdown of the wattage that you're using from each one of your bulbs that she recognized through the app. Now, if I scroll down a little bit, you will see I got a trend section. The trend section will show me which light. So it says time on for living room lights. That's the one that's using 3.7 hours. Now, right beside the trend, to the right, you have see more. If I click on that, it's going to get more detail. So it's going to show me some information that I can use, like fun facts. And then it's telling me the time that the studio lights left is on, the time that the studio right light is on, the time that the spotlight right is on, the time that the spotlight studio. So as you can see, it's going to all the bulbs that's connected to the app and how long they've been on for a certain period of time. So it's keeping track of all of that information. And this is good information for you to keep track of your energy use, especially if you leave lights on in another room that you're not in. It surprisingly show you how much you've been leaving that light on and how much energy you've been wasting for a certain period of time. Okay, so if you go to the list of the bulbs that the app is monitoring and you notice some of the bulbs are not being monitored, you might have to go in there and manually tell it to monitor these bulbs. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So right below the graph, you're going to see track energy used by individual devices. So once you click on that, it's going to bring up this list. And it's going to show you the bulbs that need more information for energy estimation. So in order for me to add the bulbs that's not being energy monitored right now, I would need to click on it. For instance, this backyard bulb. And I would have to tell it to actually start monitoring this. And then it's gonna come up with the screen right here. So what I have to do is click get started and I have to actually put the wattage that that bulb is using. So I know for sure it's 11 watt bulb, LED bulb, smart bulb. It's made by Cree. And I click that information, save it. And now it's gonna work on estimating that energy. And now it's on that list of being monitored for energy use. So from that point on, it's going to let you know how much that bulb is using as far as wattage 
and how long it's been on for each day. And right at the bottom, as you can see, it's going to give you a suggested routine. All right, so that's going to be it. I want to thank you for taking the time for watching this video. Have a good one, and I'll see you next time.